What's going on guys, Explict here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to downgrade your PS3 um, from whatever update you're at, um, 70, 4.78 and below and then show you guys how to install Rebug 4.78 DEX. Um, yeah, so first off I'm going to show you guys what the fo um, folder format has to be on the USB. Um, so first up of course you're going to need a USB um, then you want to make a new folder inside of the USB called PS3 in all caps then just go inside that folder create another folder called update there you go guys and then in this folder this is where you place your this is where you place your downgrader um, if you're on Kex, uh, just the standard one before Dex, uh, you, I'll show you guys how to install. Um, I'll, sh I'll put a um, just a standard Rogero downgrader in there, not the Dex version. Um, the Dex version is for people that are already on Dex. It just, I don't know, I've just found it works quicker than the standard Rogero. Um, and here we go, now we can ins rename it, so you just want to, most of the time it won't delete this PUP at the end of it, so you just want to type in PS3 up that dot PUP, exactly like that, and then once you've got that on there, you can now eject, safely eject your um, USB by clicking right click on the USB then clicking eject and you'll see down this corner here you'll see USB is safely ejected um, now I'll meet you guys back on the PS3 alright guys so we're back on the PS3 and the first thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna plug in your USB device um, so I'm gonna plug mine in now out of the computer and it is now plugged in so you will be able to scroll to the far left once you've got it plugged in and go to system update but first of all before you do that you just want to disable your network just for safety measures just disable your network and then you want to go to you're going to have all these other options here you just want to go to update via storage media then you want to click on the 3.55 ps3 up that dot pup and once you click on this, it'll start to install 3.55 um, official firm, not official, uh, Rogero on your PlayStation 3, um, taking it back to that older update. And then you guys will be able to re-upgrade to 4.78 DEX. Um, and yeah guys, so I'm going to speed this part of the video up for you guys so you don't have to hear me rambling on the whole time. But yeah guys, I'll whack on a little bit of music and you guys can... Just watch it update. Alright guys, so once the update has installed, it's going to 
turn your PS3 on as normal um, but you will notice that it is got the old 3.5 I'm just loading up Reebok toolbox to show you guys that just real quick I could have went to system info but I chose the hard way okay so system information it is 3.55 and it's now on CEX or like the target type is DEX but 3.55 is the target family we're aiming for now I'll meet you guys back on the computer where Alrighty guys, so once you are back on your computer, you now will be able to delete the old update off your USB um, just by going into the folders. Uh, so it's a bit slow because of the Elgato running. Um, but yeah, you want to go to the 3.55 update and right click delete it yes okay once that is gone now you can get your 4.78.1 DEX rebug and install it on your USB um, all these firmwares that I'm showing here will be put into the description with download links um, yeah so you guys will be able to download them from the description just easy click on and I'll pretty much download straight away. But just quickly, before, while this downloads, could we please, if this video helps you out and you enjoy it, um, could we please leave a like on the video? And let's go for 30 likes on the video, guys. And yeah, so this this download doesn't normally take this long, but it I think it is around. What is it? Up? I'll just check what the um how big it is because I, th I think they're about uh, two three hundred megabytes if I'm correct yeah 203 203 megabytes um, but yeah it's just about to finish up here it's getting real close to the end and we do the, follow the same steps we did before when it went on our USB you just want to right click on the yeah the right click on it and then you want to go down to rename like we did before and then you just want to delete everything in the name except for the n p s3 up that then once you've done that you can go ahead and eject the usb again like did before um, come on taking a while just to eject it but yeah I don't know why it's taking so long but yeah there we go alright eject and once you see that save to remove message pop up in the bottom right corner you can remove the USB from the computer and yeah guys let's get on with it on me Alright guys, so now we will install 4.7, um, 4.78 Rebug Dex, and here we go, we're just going to click on it now, and as I did before, I'm just going to whack on the music, so you guys don't obviously have to watch this whole process, and I'll meet you guys back on when we're on Rebug.
guys so it's been quite some time before I realized this update did complete um, it's because I started playing my PS4 if you guys didn't notice that I did um, do the Easter egg for three maps uh, I did Zetsubu no Shima, God Krovi and the Shadows of Evil I'll leave the links down below if you guys want to go check them out um, and yeah guys so we now have um, Rebug 4.78.1 DEX um, and yeah there are a few new features that you guys will see down the bottom right corner you'll see that there is a new IP address tab down the bottom and yeah, there's a few more there's a bunch of new Rebug options and another feature added for me that you guys might not have seen might not have either um, is my old firmware didn't allow me to have fake save data so now that I do have that it's a real good because then I don't have to um, play the prologue every time I play GTA 5 and yeah so thanks guys for watching um, it's been explicit here and I'll see you guys in the next video peace